Agnolo Doni was a very wealthy cloth merchant, member of the wool guild, collectors of gem and antiquity, sophisticated patron. He also commissioned Michelangelo, the famous Tondo. This man, who invested his wealth in art, asked Raphael, in the first of his Florentine years, to portray him and his wife, Maddalena Strozzi. Although he is depicted three quarters to the right, his gaze is turned to the viewer with a proud and at the same time serene and calm expression, showing a loose naturalness. There are many details that denote his condition as a rich bourgeois. The rings on his hands, the cloth dress, the black velvet corset, the fine white shirt that slightly comes out from the dress. Despite all these details, the center of the painting, however, remains the face of the protagonist and his state of mind. Even the landscape in the background seems to accompany his posture, with the hills descending from left to right, following the line of the shoulders, and where every detail is in the right place, just like the two clouds in the upper corners of the panel, which artfully occupy the empty space. The contrasts between light and dark enhance the face, and you can even see the minute mark of the brush in the very thin, frizzy hair. Among the several portraits that Raphael painted in Florence, these are the only ones whose name has been passed on since the time of Vasari. And, thanks to the extraordinary psychological introspection, they had a lasting success. Raphael, Portrait of Agnolo Doni, 1505-1506.